<laughs> so, you want the keystone, right? How about detaining me first? What I gotta do? Oh boy. <laughs> Nothing all that difficult. This is the battle arena. Show me your fighting skills. Just you, boy. I ex I'm expecting a good fight. I'll give it on a shot because, like, even if we die, it's just that. Wait, current battle point zero. Do you get nothing out of this? Is there no reward and just... I always forget the turtle thing right there as they would just ignore fire. Oh no, it gave me seven there. Shit. Breaking weapon is just awful. I don't even know why I'm basing attacking really when I if you don't want to extend this at all. And now we're at 34 on that one. And that is very rude for the all material break to show up that early. they did. Poison somewhere in there, I didn't even notice. Okay, I thought you were gonna use grav uh, gravity right there. That would have been so annoyed, but oh well. This is the whole thing doesn't matter, anyways. Poison is ticking far faster than I would have thought. Hey, a bot.
I should just actually get rid of the point because it's taking every now and then it's getting free damage when I don't want it to. This is seven, I believe, right? And then the next one is eight. <laughs> well done, young man. And as promised, you can take it. Oh, and I'll give you this too. Keystone, Protect Vest, and Choco Feather? We shall meet again! <laughs> Thank fuck, that's done. Now I will never have to come back here again. The Choco Feather is Dexterity 10. Alright. I do not know what dexterity would really get me that I wouldn't get from the other stuff. And also protect vest. Do I already have one of those? I do, yeah, and it's the Vitality 10 one. Okay. Alright, let's get out of here. Actually, did they give me my battle points right there? No, they don't. It's just for show. Good to know with that, I guess. I was about to be kind of annoyed. Also, increase this timer fill. Oh, fancy. That's also actually good to know. But alright. With that done, let's step out of the fucking much golden saucer and never look back. Wait, excuse me, sir. I'm sorry, the tram is out of order, right? What? So... I'm really sorry. I'm afraid you won't be able to leave until it's fully repaired. <laughs> What's wrong? Too bad, it happened so. I know, let's stay at the hotel. They know me here. I'll go talk to them. I will let you know once the repairs are completed. Oh, it just automatically puts me there. Okay. <laughs> we don't usually get the chance to be together like this, huh? Cloud, how about it? Can you tell me what's happened so far? I don't really know what's going on because I wasn't here in the beginning. Yeah, I'm, f I'm for that. Good idea. I've been here since the beginning, and I still don't know what the hell's going on either. Cloud, the hell's going on? Come on, tell us. All right, I'll give it a shot, I guess. Phew. We're going after Sephiroth. 
Sephiroth must be in search of the Promised Land. The, prom the Promised Land? A land full of Mako energy, or at least that's what the Shinra believe. I don't know if it actually exists. The Cetras will return to the Promised Land, a land that promises boundless happiness. Cetra? Not some kind of disease? That's what the ancients call themselves. Hey, didn't you listen to the Elder of the Cosmo, Can uh, Cosmo Canyon? You don't know where the Promised Land of the Ancients is. You search and travel until you feel it. Then you just know that you found it. Eris, can you feel it too? I think so. So, uh, Sephiroth is traveling the world because he's searching for the Promised Land. Is that it? He's searching for that, and one other thing. The Black Materia. I heard from Dio. Uh, that man in a black cape was looking for the Black Materia. Never heard of Black Materia. How many women with black capes and number tattoos are there? You know, of course, my tattoo is number 13. Bot number two, what the fuck? How did you get that uh, tattoo? Hojo put it on me. The rest are just war scars, but the number was done by Hojo. So there are at least 13. You know, I think Hojo did something to those men in the black in the black capes. But I don't know what it has to do with Sephiroth, though. That's why I think we should just go after Sephiroth himself. Yeah, me too. It's all just too damn confusing. And? I'm sorry. Forget it. I think I'm tired. I'm going to bed now. What's with, what's with that all of a sudden? What? That's it? I'm going to bed. Is that all? How about the black materia? You wouldn't understand even if I told you. Now I'm going to take action. We're starting tomorrow. Cloud. I'm number 13. Am I going to go mad too? I don't know what Hojo did to you, but you've been alright so far, right? But... Be strong. But... I... Stop it, Red 13. Be strong! Tifa? You're not the only one who's worried. I don't know what's going on, but we're in a bad situation. Hey, Sid. Let's go back to our rooms. Sid's already knocked the fuck out. Hee <laughs> hee. What's wrong? Let's go on a date. Is no one gonna question the room we're in right now? There's a flail on the bottom left. There's a, I think, a container. And in the right, I swear that's like a neon Iron Maiden. With a shackle right next to it. What? A-D-A-T-E. Or haven't you ever gone on one? Don't take me for a fool. Well, not a real one. <laughs> Sir, I've got Aerith in my date? Wait, there's a... What? You can get different ones, I'm assuming? I mean, it's a horror-themed hotel. Also, it's the minibar. Ah. Fun fact about Iron Maiden, they were just decorations, not actually usable. I... Hmm. I think I remember hearing something about it like that. There was a Tifa one as well. There was a Tifa, Aerith, Yuffie, and Barrett. Really? Is there a way to, like, cycle... What's it called? Is there a way to, like, see if you got the other ones as well? Or... Is you, do you only get one and that's the one you get and if you skip it or say no then it's like alright you just miss it oh, man. 
You only get one? Alright, then I guess we got Eris, so sure. Barrett is them there um, uh, if there are no others. Oh. Flowers at the start. Oh, really? Hmm. All right. The only two for getting Barrett's. You get relationship points through the game, and you have to uh, tank the girls to get Barrett. Oh. Uh... <laughs> well, let's see how let's see how Cloud is gonna respond to this. Then, actually, my little the trusty coin right here. If it lands on side of the angel, we will say. Don't take me for a fool, even though that doesn't really sound angelic. And if we land on the side of the devil, we will say, well, not a real one. Top, bottom, let's see what we get. How does Cloud react to this? Angel. Alright. Don't take me for a fool. Hey, I'm a little, hey, a little touchy, aren't we? Oh, come on. Oh, well, come on. Let's go. Hey. <laughs> Tonight's enchantment night. All the attractions are free. How about it, you two? There's going to be an enchanting show at the event square. Come on, let's go. I'm not controlling at all, so I guess we're just doing it. Congratulations. You are our 100th couple today. You two will play the leads in tonight's show. What? Oh, no. Oh, no. No, it's not Todd. Just play it however you want, and the rest of the cast will cover up for you. Wait, that's a thing? Come on this way. Hey. This sounds like fun. Come on, Cloud. Let's do it. I can't move still, so it's just we're on a cutscene right path right here. Long, long ago, an evil shadow appeared over the peaceful kingdom of Gladia. Princess Rhoda was kidnapped by the evil Dragon King, Valvados. What will become of her? Just then, the legendary hero Alfred appears. Oh, you must be the legendary hero, Alfred! Hey, it's your line! Yeah, you! Ahem. <laughs> oh, you must be the legendary hero, Alfred! By my soul, please, please save Princess Rosa! Now please, talk to the king. Oh, legendary hero, Alfred, you have come to save my beloved Rosa! On the peak of the dangerous mount dwells the evil dragon king, Valvaros! Who kidnapped Princess Rosa? But you can't beat the evil Dragon King now. Talk to one who can help you. Who will you talk to, the knight or the wizard? We're a fighter, so I'm gonna say let's grab a wizard with us. I am the great wizard Vorman. Whom, uh, what do you wish to know? The evil Dragon King. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. I wonder how much you could tank a date. How much can the game actually like lift up the this person does not know what they're doing and it will still succeed in the end? I mean it's obvious it's the first answer. But there's a part where I'm supposed to pick every wrong option and see if we still will quote unquote win or come out on t on the other side. But sure, the evil dragon king's weakness. Ah, uh, ah, the weakness of the evil dragon king. It must be. It must be. Yes, it must be true love. The power of love is the only weapon that can withstand the fangs of the evil dragon king. Oh. What is going to happen next? Oh, legendary hero, look! You can ask the world is hilarious. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> I am the evil dragon king, Valvados. I have not harmed the princess. I have been expecting you. 
Please help me, legendary hero. How was that? Ah, here I come, legendary hero, Alfred. I already know your name. And now, legendary hero, here is what will, what will happen to your beloved. A kiss. The power of true love. <laughs> oh, I see what you mean. You can F this up really and it's hilarious. <laughs> All right, chat, kiss the dragon. <laughs> what do we want here? I have a, uh, I have dice. I have dice. Oh, no, 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 no. We leave it up to chance. I have a D6 right here. One to two, we kiss the princess. Three to four, we kiss the king. Five to six, we kiss the evil dragon. The dragon's weakness, uh... The kiss of the dragon's weakness, though, it is to be done on, the, on him, right? I want to ask y'all what you want. <laughs> yeah, we should, but, oh, God, it could be funny. How they going, you Ponyum King? Welcome. Now, hold on. Roll the dice and see which option we get. Once again, one to two, we're gonna kiss the princess. Three to four, we're gonna kiss the king, who's just been standing there for no reason. And then five to six, we're gonna kiss the dragon, because technically they said, true love is the dragon's weakness. So that only works on the on the dragon, not the princess. Boy, does it make sense. <laughs> we're gonna go with whatever the dice says, and... <laughs> it landed on four. <laughs> oh, King, my beloved. <laughs> oh, Alfred, in truth, I too. Ah, curses the power of love. He's just floating up there now. <laughs> oh, beloved. Love has triumphed! Now, let's all return and celebrate! Yes, let's! Yes, let's! <laughs> Cloud just dances off too. <laughs> oh, how profound the power of love! And so, the legendary hero Alfred and our story lives on happily ever after. But what? You must be kidding! Oh, that was fun. Hey, let's go to the gondola. I love how she doesn't comment it at all about it either. Two, please. Here you are. Two tickets. Enjoy the sights of Gold Saucer. That's made out of wood. Wow, how nice! <laughs> if you kiss the dragon to turn into a princess, ah, oh, I should have done that. Oh, look, Cloud. Oh, the chocobo race is actually happening. We can see active rigging happen in real time. Them fucking scamming us out of our out of our winnings. It's so pretty. The screen just turned blank there for a second. Wait, I have a question. If you get Barrett, do you still get in this exact same scene? Or like similar is seen, as in, like, you would have gone to the play and you would have been brought on stage with Barrett? Beautiful, isn't it? It's all black. First off, it bothered me how you looked that uh, you looked exactly alike. Different dialogue about, yes? Oh, excellent. Technically different people, but look exactly the same. The way you walk, gesture. I think I must have seen him again in you. But you're different. 
things are different. The world turned off outside of our little gondola. Cloud, I'm searching for you. Hmm? I want to meet you. But I'm right here. I know, I know. What I mean is... I want to meet... you. I had fun tonight. Let's do it again. Uh, don't, uh, don't you like him uh, being with me? No, I don't. <laughs> That's so fucking blunt and rude. I wonder how much Dirge of Cerberus spoiled? I don't remember much of Dirge of Cerberus, but what I do remember? Not spoiling that much. Unless in this game we do genuinely just go to hell. In which case, Dirge of Cerberus spoiled a fuck ton of that. Because I want to say, at the end of Dirge of Cerberus, you are just like climbing or like flying down to some sort of like demonic hell and fighting shit with a gun. I don't remember the context of why, but I remember like the platform being kind of awful. That's not it. Was Vincent the protag? Yes, it was all Vincent being a protag. I'm glad. Next time we come, let's take our time and go on more rides. Oh, look at the time. We better get going. In Dirt of Vincent is the protag. It is like an almost over-the-shoulder shooter. And it is very weird. Hey, what's Case Sis doing? I knew it. Is that the keystone? Hey, Kate Sith! Oh, that's probably... I have to that. No, not... not go! Speed! Fuck! He went into the wander... or wonder? Talk about. <laughs> Trying to press A on him. What the fuck? Hey, over here, the keystone. Well done. Hey! But wait a second, I won't run to hide! Yes, I was a spy. I was hired by Shinra. I trusted you. I can't believe you! I couldn't help it. How about if we go on like nothing ever happened? Really? You think that'll fly? No way, Cat. You got a lot of guts acting like a friend but being a spy. Then what are you gonna do? Kill me? Is that an option? You'd just be wasting your time if you tried this- if you tried. This body is just a toy anyways. My real body is at Shinra headquarters in Midgar. I'm controlling this toy cat from there. So you're from Shinra? Who are you? Tell me! Well, I can't tell you my name. We're not getting anywhere. See, I told you! Talking won't do any good! So, can't we just continue our journey? You think I'm joking? All right, yes, I am a Shinra employee. But we're not enemies, we're not entirely enemies. Something's bothering me. I think it's your way of life. You don't get paid, you don't get praised, yet you still risk your lives to continue on your journey. Saying that makes me, it just makes me think about my life. I don't think I'd feel too good if things ended the way they are now. 
And so on and so on. He'll never tell the truth. Want a spy? Always a spy. We can't go on with someone like that. Come on, get real. Just as I thought. Talking will make him a bit of a difference. But I prepared something ju in case this happens. Why don't you listen to this? Papa, Tifa. Hey, that's Marlene. Hey, it's the flower lady. Flower lady. So, you have to do what I say. You're the lowest. I didn't want to do this. Using dirty tricks and taking hostages. But this is how it is. No compromises. So, why don't we go on as we did? Tomorrow is the Temple of the Ancients, right? I know where it is. So I'll tell you later. Of course, we'll get there after the Shinra, but you'll have to deal with that. Well, we're stuck. We have to do what he says. No, we don't. I wonder if Marlene is alright. I wonder what happened to Mom. Uh, weirdly, thank you for the elixir. I just want to see what was in there. We got the elixir used, yeah. It's 15 mobility, 15 intelligence. Damn it, I can't interact with that at all. There's nothing else here. What took you so long, Cloud? Oh yeah, about the Temple of the Ancients. I think if we take the tiny Bronco east towards the sea, we should be able to find it. Well then, shall we get going? Who's gonna go? I wanna go. I'm going for sure. <laughs> oh wait, maybe they're at... Mm. Either there are three more characters? Oh wait, you can't get rid of Eris. Okay. Okay. And I never got any of the stuff because I know she's gonna die eventually. Alright, if she's required to be on the team, then we'll just have to work with it then. How's it going, Mickey Sara? Welcome. Don't give her Vincent shit. Alright. I mean, Vincent doesn't really have much right now. All fire, MP+, plus, ice, all, and nothing else. And I think he still has the Eden coat, yeah. Alright, I'll give Eris then, at the very least, something to heal, and that's it. For you to tell who you like from this scene. I mean, it's just it's like people keep on moving in and out of the fucking party! That's Poisoner. That's life. I'll get the heal off of that. Actually, hold on. Let's just remove all from you. Arrange it. And now I gotta... We gotta actually decide on the builds right here. By the way, they're going to Ange or Not Angelo. Arrow. Welcome. Actually, wait, do I have any new equips I can give her? I mean, aside the star pendant. Hi, Angel Arrow. <laughs> I 
I mean, I can give her the golden armlets, I guess. It links these two and gives her a bit more defense. If she's required, she's gonna have to actually be used. And that's for the weapon. We got her double, but... I mean, if you're gonna be here, you might as well be getting us some double stuff. Alright, there's the restore one. We'll get heal in Asuna there as well, so that way she can at least do that to us. We have another all that we do want to train up, but... All haste, I guess, maybe? That works in its own little way. From there... More to have heal on. I want to give her the white cape so she doesn't get frogged and stop from casting. Probably should. My biggest fear right now is that if she's gonna leave the party event, or like, for all I know, if this is gonna be the scene where she dies, so she's required that like, I'm not gonna be able to get her stuff for like the immediate next fight. I mean, I'll give you steel, why not? Alright, for you, Sid. All fire doesn't really help you that much, but it's alright. On Cloud or Sid, maybe, maybe. Probably on Cloud, because Sid right now is using the championship belt and getting all the strength from it. We don't have much that gives them strength. That's the one problem. Like, almost any material we give him will just reduce his strength. Flow can technically add luck. Cover adds vitality, but that's going to be for Cloud. How are summons again? They are also, uh, they're magic, but not strength. They don't reduce strength at the very least, but they reduce maximum HP. HP plus, I was going to give that to Cloud, but technically he's also already at 3000, so that's actually all right. This one gives magic and magic defense. You think you want? You think we should use Sid as the um, uh, HP cover person? HP cover and counterattack. As uh, a spear, is he can do that from the back row as well, right? Fears melee? Ah, oh, shit. Oh, well, he's gonna be in the front row then with us. But long range, and we, thanks to having not really much need for other material, it can work out for him as well, yeah. This is vitality, this is dexterity. Luck is not needed, but we'll see what else we have room for. I 
All right, so we have counter, cover, long range, HP up. And then, oh wait, enemy lore, huh. I just realized this technically is, I thought it was an item use, not a materia. We have three enemy lures. Yeah, we can give him preemptive. He's already got throw as well, or steel right now, and throw for vitality. All right, with that, Sid is at 3,776. He has the championship belt, the golden armlet, and his spear, which we've yet to find a new, a new one of. I'll give you the white cape then. And Cloud for speed. He either could put on the power vest or the choco feather for speed. He technically can do vitality as well, but. Wait. You are. That is. Yeah. His blade is still doubles. All right, so we still want to like grind up certain materials. He can put them on a sword. Just understand it's gonna reduce his strength probably. Yoshiyuki, I do not know what that is. Oh, wait, you mean the, um, uh, weapon, yeah. This one. Powers up when an ally is down. It is also a doubled. Actually, it's, it's not a double, never mind. But it is a very large uh, power boost. I would. I mean. Yeah, if we're not scooping the champion shell, the championship belt, I don't think we want the Yoshi because that would just be stacking on more attack to more power. And. I still value double for materia grinding and all that. Even if we already grinded up one materia to completion, there's still more we can do. Like, let me make sure enemy skill is there so we can do his magic. Max HP and MP, I might. Actually, you know what? If you can throw, if you uh, let, remind me of the location, sure. Because I'll probably buy one or two of each, just so that way we can put that on Cloud and, for all I know, even him up, uh, Aerith. Head south of the town surrounded by trees. Oh, it's that one. Midwestern continent in the south. Gotcha. I mean, he doesn't really even need those. That can be grinded. Then with elemental. Oh, they're just good to grind now that we know that how much they sell for. Death blow is luck. Sense is nothing. Manipulate is good to have though to getting certain skills. Odin is magic and magic defense up. And that's about all I feel like I need to put on. 
and they don't have an Impolite, so Cloud does. So at the very least, we can count on that to get skills. But alright, let's give him back Omni Slash. Also, wait, shop. Game? <laughs> you say shop, but what the fuck do you mean I can't go in there? Maybe if I leave and come back? Then see you later. Thank you for coming to the Ghost Hotel. Uh, for the rations, please step up to the counter. Uh, the shop, though? Welcome. Hotel shop. I mean, we can buy others now. And not care about a lot of things here. Top of anything we're running low on, this cure's small. I bought too many of those, but alright, sure. Things only have 16. Po you don't sell high potions, so that's annoying. We can go by the counter as well. Talk to the pumpkin? It just laughs, right? Yeah. Just does that. Nothing else happens. Now let's go grab the HP and MP ones. Go grab the HP MP ones and then I guess I'll move on to what the game's trying to get me to do. Short fruit break, welcome back, Leon. We'll save while we're out here. Alright, so... Middle of the... Western continent. So, where we are, technically. But it's surrounded by trees. That's the one that we were in before, right? With the broken reactor and the frogs? I think that was it. I'm sorry, how much did Sid do? That's a... A very noticeable difference. That was Tifa and her death sentence build. Oh, okay, I see what you're getting at. Yeah, like, if you can, like, engineer that scenario and then just count on that, you can hit 999 every single time. Or, like, cap damage, right? Wait, no, this isn't it.
Okay, no, it's not this place. I thought it was. Fuck. Oh, wait. Maybe it's in... No, it wouldn't be the items, right? I mean, they've got high potions, but... Nope. I still got it wrong. Red's hometown? Ah. I have been deceived. Lied to. Stop putting me at the bottom. There we go. Alright, Red's hometown was... I don't exactly remember where, but... We'll get there. They're like, Cloud's doing 300 on a swing. Said 900. It's incredible how much the championship belt does. This way, I believe. Wait, what? Back? Rude! Jesus. Are you gonna... Alright, sit to curve it. Actually, also... Wait, that might be another thing. Hold on. Order. Cloud is the front row, Eris is the back row because of a mage, Sid can be in the back row just for the damage reduction, as well as <laughs> being able to, what's it called, still attack at the long range. That's why Sid, uh, Cloud was doing only 300. I thought he should have been doing more. here, but for some people, this is like their upgraded weapons. Alright, the material shop, I want to say, was to the right here. She needs 80 kills. Yeah, that's not gonna fucking happen. And yeah, HP plus and MP plus. So I now own two, and I, you know what? I probably should just get three, one for each of them. Technically, can you stack multiple HP pluses on one unit? They stack? Alright, then HP is probably very important to just generally have. And yeah, a Angelo, wrong location. It was in the Red 13th hometown, not the one in the forest. You can tell by the music.
going, oh, I didn't have it. This is Cosmo Canyon. Yep. So the HP up two of them on him, so he's at 4,300. Aerith needs some amount of HP as well, I guess. She can start leveling this up. And then for Cloud, like this elemental can be traded for an HP plus. This heal, another HP plus. This gravity, which is the string. Could even be an MP plus. Or another HP plus. I don't know why I'm being so... Buy a little bit more, because I'm pretty sure there's gonna be a point where I'm probably gonna be stacking two or three of those per character once they're max level, just to, like, get as much out of it. Nope, not this one. Upstairs. Kate Sith, let us know about where we need to go south along something, I don't know. But if we need to take the plane, we gotta pick it up and then go. Now we can actually see the comparison and damage for both of them. 951. 625. Okay, that's more what I was expecting. Still, 300 bonus damage for just having one equip is wild. I do not remember where Kate says said, so I might rely on you guys to, like, let me know if I'm on the right path or not. <laughs> but she lost when I painted this. Bastards! <laughs> I was paying attention, just... <laughs> Fuck, I'm forgetful. Wait, there's a bridge right there. I don't know, I wouldn't know where it leads, but there is a dot all the way up here. That was it. Shut up, Arrow, not you two. Part of a bad fighter. <laughs> 
Put HP on the double gear. All of them? I did. At least the best that I could. Not everyone has double gear. Like, Cloud has it on his room blade. She has, like, stuff for her um, uh, weapon. And what's it called? Sid, unfortunately, just doesn't have a double gear at all. Like, that's all right here. I can only put the MP Plus up there, but that's about it. And for Aerith, it's up here, HP Plus. And for him, there's nothing I can do about it. I don't know why I thought that was something else. Also, actually, question: Are we now technically in disc a uh, disc two of Final Fantasy Seven yet, or are we still in disc one somewhere? Still in disc one. Damn. I just gotta say, that would have made it infinitely more hilarious to play the remake and judge that as all of Final Fantasy VII when that is, I wanna say, barely half, maybe a third of disc one's content. God, that would have been so great, though, judging it on that, because that's what they demanded full price for. It's the power of padding. I mean, yeah. Wait, do you have anything for me now that I have the keystone? Huh. Ultimate destruction magic. Supposed to be hidden somewhere in a temple of the ancients. Ultimate destruction magic? Hold up, what? Come on, I said don't take it seriously. No, 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 I want to take it seriously. But lately I haven't been able to get the materia materials. How can I get you the stuff to make the best shit ever? I'm gonna have to look into that. Wait, no. I don't think it's in here because this is... Wait, what the hell are you? Not our problem, I guess. Though 440 experience and 45 AP is actually not bad. May or may not be it. Well, apparently 93 gigabytes was the compressed number. PS5 players for the first remake game uh, got two discs for 150 gigabytes of data. 